Liam Gallagher has stirred up controversy again, and this time, it's after the Oasis reunion tour left millions of fans disappointed in a chaotic ticketing debacle. With his typical brashness, Liam lashed out online, telling frustrated fans to shut up and even joked about kneeling tickets only. In today's video, we're diving into the shocking social media rant that has many questioning whether the iconic Britpop star has lost touch with his fan base. Stick around as we break down the whole mess, from dynamic pricing nightmares to Liam's smug responses. Oasis fans were beyond excited when the legendary band announced their reunion tour, marking a return after 15 years apart. The news sent shockwaves through the music world, with fans scrambling to secure tickets for what promised to be one of the biggest events in recent music history. However, things quickly turned sour when ticket buyers were met with hours-long queues, dynamic pricing that saw ticket costs skyrocket, and many walking away empty-handed. Despite the frustration, Liam Gallagher wasted no time making his feelings known online, and as you might expect, he didn't hold back. Taking to X, formerly known as Twitter, he posted, Oasis are back, you're welcome, along with a snarky jab about the band's unchanged attitude. But when fans criticized the ticketing approach, Liam's response was simple, shut up. It was a response that did little to calm the already heated situation, and things only escalated from there. When asked how he was feeling about the chaos, Liam doubled down, saying he felt smug AS, a comment that rubbed many fans the wrong way, especially those who had waited up to 11 hours to buy tickets. Gallagher's responses didn't stop there, though. He even joked about having loads of spare tickets but said they cost £100,000 and would be for kneeling only. These remarks, coming at a time when fans were already feeling let down by the process, ignited a wave of backlash. Many accused the singer of being out of touch with his fan base and pointed out the hypocrisy of his comments, especially after an old tweet resurfaced where Liam had criticized his brother Noel for charging high prices at a solo gig. In that tweet from 2017, he called Noel a four charging $350 for tickets and the U.S. fans were quick to remind Liam of his past words, with one commenter noting, this hasn't aged well. As the drama unfolded, it became clear that dynamic pricing was at the center of the controversy. For those unfamiliar, dynamic pricing works by adjusting ticket prices based on demand, meaning the more people want them, the higher the price goes. While this system is supposed to prevent ticket reselling and scalping, it left many Oasis fans feeling cheated. Some reported prices more than doubling during the buying process, with tickets going from £150 to over £350. One fan, Diane Green, shared her frustration after waiting four hours and paying £357 for a single ticket, only to later learn that Oasis had added more dates. She said she felt absolutely fuming and regretted spending so much, calling the entire experience disgraceful. Diane's story isn't unique, as many others took to social media to voice their anger over the pricing strategy and the overall lack of transparency during the sale. Oasis eventually responded, distancing themselves from the ticketing fiasco by placing the blame on their management and ticketmaster. They claimed they were unaware dynamic pricing would be used and said they had no control over the system. This explanation did little to satisfy fans, many of whom still hold the band accountable for the mess. To ease the backlash, Oasis announced two additional dates for the reunion tour, offering a chance for those who missed out to try again. However, some fans, like Diane, were already too disillusioned to give it another shot. Despite the mounting criticism, Liam Gallagher has remained unapologetic. His shut-up remark has become the latest in a long line of infamous moments where the singer's brash attitude has landed him in hot water. However, it's clear that both he and his brother Noel are keen to make the reunion tour a success, even if the road to get there has been rocky. Sources close to the band suggest that Liam and Noel have discussed the ticketing issues and are now working with their teams to possibly change Ticketmaster's policies. But for many fans, the damage has already been done, and Gallagher's smug attitude throughout this ordeal has only worsened the situation. So, what do you think? Has Liam Gallagher gone too far with his comments, or is this just classic Liam being Liam? And will fans forgive the Oasis ticket debacle, or will it cast a shadow over the highly anticipated reunion tour? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below! 
Don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates on all things Oasis and music news.